Welcome to Cook, Serve, Delicious 2 and my continuing attempts to do all the Chef for Hire events at all the restaurants and get a gold medal at each one. This time around it is continuation of Secrets of the Deep. And the third shift and the last one I've currently got unlocked, which apparently has lobsters, crab legs and... Well, it's not soup, but it's something you add some sauce to and then add other bits to once your sauce is cooked. I don't know what it's called, but I'm sure I'll figure it out at some point. And wine is the drink, and a couple of sides. So off we go with chef number three. As always, I want a gold medal, which means I need a perfect day, which means I need no mistakes. And once again, with this wonderful restaurant, there are no entrees I can prepare in advance. All I can prepare is sides. And someone's dares come into my restaurant wearing shorts, athletic gear basically. Oops, that was the wrong button to press. I almost got rid of my sides before they'd fully cooked. Okay, and here's lobster. Okay, I've got a choice of lobster or king lobster. And the K and the L keys being right next to each other, I'm going to have to be careful as to which one I actually select. And custom gazpacchio order. I don't know how to pronounce that word, but it's uh, puree. White puree. Looks disgusting. Number four wants a king lobster. Yeah, the lobster takes a little while to cook, apparently. I'll wait for it to get progress a bit further before I actually cook any more, more sides. So I've got plenty in time for the rush hour. And here's my first lobster being done. Okay, and apparently it wants butter to go with it, and that's it. Well, that wasn't too difficult. So the most difficult food I've got is this gazpacchio thingy, which wants cilantro and shrimp. Uh, number five is done, and number four actually needs coconut sauce. Six is that, and number seven is some kind of... Oh, okay. You get posh wines in this restaurant rather than the usual wines. Ah, uh, number one's done. Two wants a lobster, number three needs the trash doing, number one wants a king lobster, number three, number six is done, and you want yellow tomato, ooh, I almost got that key wrong. Right, and whilst that is going on, perfect time to create some more sides. Okay, uh, okay. Rush hour starts, uh, coconut sauce. Alright, let's do number five next because that's easy. Number one, spicy sauce. Okay, you want S beard. Okay. Serpent beard, apparently. Okay, when I get to number three was the one I want to do next. Avocado, which is the A key. Must remember that. Number four wants milk and shrimp. Alright, let's do the trash. And let's get a couple of lobsters going. Seven, two, okay, just a standard lobster. Number one, which is that, and cucumber, sea key. Number four, also wants a cucumber. Number five, would like puree. Well, that's everything cooking. Looks like number three is going to win the race to be the first to be served. Cilantro, corn, and pink flour. By number one, number six, coconut sauce. That would be the C key. Number seven, which would be spicy sauce. Number three is a wine. Okay. Cherry, 1973. No idea. Let's do number two. Oh, okay, milk, corn, and small flour. Number four, balsamic. Tomatoes and yellow flour. Number five, cilantro, shrimp, and a small flour. Okay. Start pack at number one. Number two is S beard or serpent beard. Six is a king. 
two lobster. Number seven wants watermelon. And number two would like a standard lobster. And gives me time to do some more sides. Okay, number three is cooked. And number four wants a king lobster. So far, so good. Number five would like a standard lobster. Number one would like cilantro, cucumbers, and a pink flower. Custom Gazpacchio order. I don't know how to pronounce that word at all. And that one's like white puree. Looks like a bowl of vomit. Asian sauce. Okay, that would be the A key. Number seven, milk and avocado. Spicy. Ginger sauce. Oh, almost hit the cheeky for ginger sauce, which would have been a mistake. Okay, they're suddenly going mad with the chores. And one of my sides has expired. Uh, number three, cilantro and feta cheese. Looks disgusting, but each to their own. Oh yeah. Okay. Never done that wine before. And now would be a good time to do some more sides. Okay, clam is L, calamari and hush puppies. Cucumber. That would be the sea key. I've got to admit, the foods in this restaurant really aren't that bad. I wish I had a better class of patron. But we can't have everything in life. Not that it really makes much difference to me, because it's not my restaurant. I'm only the chef for hire, so... Number five, vegetable. That's got to be the B key. Okay, look at old balsamic oil, corn, and a yellow flower. Kind of matches the corn, that one. Start, okay, cucumber. More cucumber. Serpent's beard wine. Avocado. Six and number seven are cooked. Number two is a king lobster. As is number six, apparently. Milk, tomatoes, and a small flower. Oh, number seven needs to be cooked. Oh, and good old puree. Okay, milk, shrimp, and a blue flower. Three, which is olive oil. Croutons? done croutons today. Ah, uh, number four well, would probably be good at this point. Olive oil, croutons, and a pink flower. Two, butter, the B key, number seven's cooked, number six, Asian sauce. Not entirely sure what Asian sauce is, but mine is not to reason why, mine is but to do or die. Milk and lettuce. Ah yes, they went for all the chores there. Nice of them to really try and put me under some pressure and fail. I can handle your chores. Do your worst. At least I can handle them at this level. When it comes to them like shift 10 and they do that to me, I will probably be screaming in pain. was a nice, relatively peaceful day at being a chef for hire. Now, it does help if I press the enter key to actually get that food cooking. Oh, they had to give me one last order before the end of the day. Fair enough. Okay, I like the, the description of this guy's shirt in green in the middle. Just eat it. 
no crude jokes or comments, please. It's corn. Three's cooked to number one. Good old balsamic with shrimp. There's my nice perfect day. There's my nice gold medal. Okay, and apparently I've locked, unlocked floor number eight. A nice red patterned carpeted floor. And that's apparently all I've unlocked. I thought there'd be more. And that was the third shift, the secrets of the deep. That's a terrible thing about having a bad short term memory. You never remember which shift it is you've just done. Yep, and next shift is the one with the oysters chowder and mussels and I've never done oysters ever in my life chowder I've done and it's also apparently the side and mussels I did for the first time a short while ago and they're not too bad to do however it's not unlocked so I can't do that one yet so I'll probably move on to absolutely next and knock off a couple of chef for hires absolutely and hopefully at some point I'll go up a level and unlock some more secrets of the deep however that's it for now as always, I hope you enjoyed, and hopefully I will see you down the road for more Chef for Hire events in Cook, Serve, Delicious 2.